Where am I? What's happening? I'm trapped in the storm. How did I get here? And where is here? Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. That was so surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear She's the class laughing at me now. Right? And frankly, it's bullshit. I can't believe I still- I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Plus, Seriously, it's perfect for my portfolio, I and I have to get my data. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st if century. You could do that to me. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st. You dig? I do love my analog now, camera. I should take a quick picture now. Photographs. Like Cocteau, he was a true Renaissance man. And his fame. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self 
portraits. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <sighs> Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. No matter who wins, this is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel excluded from this process, but I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. I had my moment in the camera eye, and I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. Just getting you you right. Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. I'm not paying $150 because for Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. What's the point she plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. She's so fucking shy. She takes selfies with a giant camera. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. American girls, it's sad to imagine a world without you. American girls, I'd like to 
be part of the world around you driving a car by the seaside watching the world from the bright side empty good nobody can see my meltdown except for me Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa! What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here.